Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ellie and this is Ellie Sims. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. It's nice to have you. Today I am continuing the Sims 4 Legacy Challenge and this is episode 17. And I wanted to start off by apologizing. I hadn't realized when I was making my last set of episodes that I had completely run out of space on my computer. <laughs> so when I exported this episode, the last episode 16 for this series, um... It didn't completely export the episode. It cut it off. And so when I posted it, the whole time I assumed that it was working, it hadn't been. So where I ran out of space on my computer, I couldn't record anymore. And I couldn't um, edit things. So I ended up taking out some of the stuff that I already had saved because I figured I already uploaded it and I already exported it. So I already have it. Then I go back and look and this episode had gotten messed up after I exported it and I had already deleted all my backup stuff for it. So I couldn't fix it and I'm so sorry for that. And I also wasn't able to record because I didn't have enough space to record. I did get me a, a second hard drive and I installed it into my computer. I was going to do an external hard drive, but it, I just this was cheaper and more space. So yay, now I have space to do more episodes. And I'm so sorry guys. As it was just a bad situation. Um, the part that got cut off is I threw the girls' birthday parties. And I also finished the aspiration that they were working on, I believe. I'll have to go back and relook at it and it'll refresh my memory. But um, I did finish some skills and I believe I, I finished the aspirations for both of them. I was really excited when I aged them up about how everything happened because I just thought it turned out so cool. For one of them, I got the dark side, and for the other, I got the light side. By that, I mean they both got hope versus order. One of them actually got a different one, um, but I'm not sure how that works. But one of them was going to go for hope, and the other one was order. And I don't know if that's something that like you unlock while you were there um, and bought two, I think it's called, because I've never actually played with a Star Wars pack. I just bought it because I, I try to buy every pack. I don't know why. I just like collecting things in this. That's just one of those things I did. So for Paulina, she is a slob. She is self-assured. She's outgoing and she's evil. So I was like, what? So I thought that's where it came in really cool. Hope versus order. And uh, for um, Bo... Let me go to her real quick. This is our little bow. They're both so cute. I just can't. And uh, for her, she is proper. She can't stand the cold. She is a dance machine. And she's a perfectionist. And I do believe she still has another... No, that's it. Proper dance machine and perfectionist. And yeah, she got a hope versus order again. So I figured, you know, one with hope and one with order, you know? I thought it was really funny that she actually got the order and uh, Paulina, who is evil, actually got hope. I don't know. <laughs> and they both have yellow eyes. Like, I don't know where they got the yellow eyes from. That's just what they got. And I haven't changed it. I didn't want to change their main features. All I did like to do is add some skin details and stuff. Help with a little bit of the shading because the game has horrible shading. Like, the Sims look weird to me without the small skin details that I get from CC. But anyhow, um, I wanted to show y'all their outfits real quick. This is Paulina's uh, everyday outfit. And this is her formal if it changes. I'm having a little bit of lag. I think it's because I have which is way too much CC stuff. And I also updated some of the CC that I had. So, you know... I, I just have a lot of CC. That's just it. Uh, this is her athletic wear right here. Her sleepwear. Party wear, which is so cute. I love her in this. Gives her a little bit of sass, but sweet. Her swimwear. And hot weather. And cold weather. And I wanted to keep them simple. Where she's evil, I wanted to make her kind of a little bit more sexy. But she's still a child. She's a teenager. So we go mild sexy because mom and dad would not allow too sexy. And then maybe when she ages, ages up into her own self, into a young adult, then I can like make some more changes. That'll be fun. And here is Bo. And Bo, she is a sweet girl. And I just wanted to give her that look that would fit her sweetness. And so this is her every day. And I think I just gave them one every day. Yeah, one every day. 
This is her formal, her sportswear, sleepwear, her party, swimwear, hot weather, and her cold weather. And I just love these two. They're just so cute. Now, I will be honest, it's been a little while since I've actually, like, played in the game. Just because I don't really feel like playing anymore unless I'm recording. I don't know. I've gotten so used to it. It's weird. Because <laughs> I want to share it. I want to have somebody to show the things that happen when when I'm playing. Um, Jose. Jose is very flirty. What, what were you doing, Jose? I think this is, like, right after the party, so everyone already left. They, everyone just left. I aged them up. I gave them their makeover. And then just like, that was it. <laughs> they had fun. Don't get me wrong. I just didn't like do so much. I actually did record quite a bit trying to skill the girls up and everything. Getting them ready to age up. I think I saw that something is wrong with Paulina. I can't remember. Uh, it says she has a disease. So I'm going to I'm gonna send her to the doctor. Maybe if it lets me. I kind of do remember that something was wrong with her. But, I mean, like I said, I lost that. Which is, like, very unfortunate. I was really upset about that. But, I'm going to send her to go to the doctor and get herself checked out. Um, I don't think the girls... No, they're not in school yet. So, I need to do that as well. Guys, I feel like it's been forever. Uh, I just need you to go to school, girly. High school, please. And the mod that I have that does this for them, the whole high school situation, it's just MC Command Center. It just makes it so that they can quit school and if I don't want them to go to school or if I want to pretend I'm homeschooling the kids in one of my gameplays, that's all it does. It comes in pretty nifty though, I really like it. Mom was helping her do her homework, that's so sweet. Dang, Lilith. You have a deep voice. Girl, you're talking about video games and she's trying to help her with her homework. Uh, let me see what all everyone needs to take care of themselves. Oh, I also re-added the Carl mod, I think. I think I remember I added it. Because I really like the whole burglar alarm thing going on. I I, I don't know. I thought it was pretty funny. <laughs> Having to worry about someone robbing your house and then beating them up for it. I really miss that from the older Sims games that I used to play. Oh, Paulina has been diagnosed with a viral disease. Sims can treat this disease with home remedies such as herbal, green, or lemon ginger tea. Orange juice, plenty of rest, as well as with other counter medications. To keep the comfortable viral disease usually go away on their own. So she probably has like a cold. Okay. I'm back to not being able to read because I got out of the habit about reading this stuff out loud every day. Um, skew, please, skew. There you go. And it is late. So, Bo, if you already finished your homework, sweetheart, I need you to go to sleep. Step in bed doing... Using the potty. <sighs> Chance. I forgot your name for a minute. I ran all my my male Sims names through my head. I was like, Dan, Daniel. <laughs> okay. Um, you have to do your work stuff. Um, I'm gonna have you troll the forums because I need you to finish uh skilling up, sir. I need you to get that skill to level nine. Uh, Amelia, do you have work tomorrow? Oh, you're cleaning. Okay. You have to reach level 4 in logic, and you don't have work today, so just play with... Who can you play with? Via is available, so let's play with Via. Hey there, little man. What do you have to do to be able to be an heir for me? I mean, technically, I guess I don't have to cap anything for him to be an heir. Um, Go play some basketball. Do that for starters and also play with the rock and stack is it called yep rock and stack oh play with him again he's he, i don't know why i find him so cute he's such a cute sim and he's so sweet he's always smiling he's so nice hey there gents hey there sir like i could have sworn i told you to do something um Order from the online pharmacy, and you have a virus. Hmm. 
I guess it really didn't say what exactly I needed. Maybe I'll just order the plano medicine and see if that helps. Oh, I know, sweetheart. Take your medicine. See if that helps. And I might have her stay home from school because she's not feeling so great. Oh, her stomach's upset. Oh, I remember. Oh, she got food poisoning from sushi. I totally forgot. Can't believe I remember that. Though, at the same time, kudos to me. Wait, what was that? Something happened? Oh, no, wait. <laughs> I already messed up. I guess that would be cheating. Uh... Ma'am, ma'am. <laughs> Go fight her, gents. See? <laughs> gents, gents. Go fight her. Okay? This is Becca Clark, and this uh, mod always chooses her to be the uh, thief. Dude, go fight her. Oh, she's going to steal the stuff first? <gasps> Dude, okay, is that chair? I thought she was stealing my computer. Wait, no, go find her for the stuff. Come on, gents. Come on. She's like, yeah, I stole your chair. What are you going to do about it? Oh, he's in the bathroom taking a selfie, dude. Cochino. Did you get beat up? Wait, no. <sighs> no, you fight. You fight her. Fight her for the stuff before she takes something else. She's going to take something important. Oh, no. No, don't take the computer. <gasps> okay, good. She just took another chair. <laughs> I mean, at least it's not that bad. Girl, go fight her. Okay. Hey, Carson. You know, you need to get you some practice. Sweetheart. Because you're going to have to fight for your... uh. Right, to be the next heir. Okay, so let's fight for that stuff. Oh, come on. You're not just going to let her leave, are you? Guys, I need my chairs back. Ma'am. Oh, she's gone. You guys, really? Can I call the cops? Can I, can I call the cops? Like, is that a thing? I could have sworn I saw somewhere that somebody called the cops. It doesn't look like it. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's a good start. I'm going to go ahead and buy the alarm. Okay. I need an alarm system. Okay. So, in case, you know, that's the thermostat. Uh, thermostat. Come on, alarm system. Stop the thief. There we go. Girl, you're scared from having your home invaded. I mean, I know. And your kids are supposed to be training to, like, become next heirs. But no. No. Jen's got beat up. Go to sleep, sweetheart. Go back to sleep. Oh, you're so sad. And somebody hurts your feelings. Girl, someone's always hurting your feelings. Everybody go back to sleep. Where's your baby? The Bemba's having fun over here. He maxed out uh, thinking. So now we need to max out communication. So let's talk to Via. Ask about the world. No, wait, you know what? That's not a good one to ask. Talk about trucks. Say some nonsense because that's just what babies do. Oh, he's reading to him. That's so cute. Ah, uh -huh. the birthdays. When's, oh, I still got a couple of days for the birthdays. Okay, so all three of them have, all three boys have a birthday. And um, I'm going to have Jose when he ages up. I think the next day he's going to go off to college. I still am not sure if I can even have them fight between Maximilian and Carson to see which one's going to be the heir. Because there's like a big age difference. I don't know. Because once I move Carson out, he can't be my heir anymore could have him do i think well i can't choose his aspiration that's the problem he already has an aspiration and I'm, and if he's my heir then i have to follow that aspiration what is his aspiration again oh 
he wants to be a super parent. Uh, spend a thousand dollars on kids stuff. Become an adult. Become a parent. Achieve level four parenting. Discipline your child or child or teen five times. Help a child with schoolwork for four hours. Achieve level six parenting skill. Have a child with the character value within range to receive a trait. And have a child with three positive character values. Go into full parent mode and achieve level 10 parenting. Um, that might be doable with, like, less time, I guess. And for the girls, let me double check again the birthdays. She's going to be a teenager in one week. Oh, he's already going to be an elder. Ah, my God. <laughs> Guys, I need four more children for this generation. If you have any ideas, like, what could I do to make it a fair competition? Because I don't know if they can actually fight for the title of heir. I mean, it all might work out. I don't know. All I know is I need to have four more kids with uh, Amelia and Jens. I mean, I know he doesn't have to be the father, but I would really like him to be the father of all her children. I know I can adopt and it doesn't matter, but it kind of matters to me. I don't know. Hey, Jens. Jens. Buddy. Buddy. Why don't you ever want to do what I tell you to do? I told you to go to sleep and you got back up on your own. I told you to do some socializing trolling on the forums. And you just walked away. Can, can can you go do it, buddy? Can you go do it? <sighs> you don't need any more food. Oh, I know. That steak is so good. Now go to sleep, dude. <laughs> oh, my God, Jens. Jens, go to sleep. Like, what is your deal? I'd, like, totally pinch you. Girl, wait, wait. What are you doing? What are you doing? Um, go use the bathroom? Yeah, I don't think they're, they're going to school today. At least she's not. And she walked in on something she cannot unsee. Well, I'm so sorry. Ah, uh, what can I get her? Can she have an orange juice in this nifty little brew a cup of or some tea? Healthy green. Yeah. Get you a cup of healthy green and that might make you feel better. Hey, Bo. I really, like, want to do some of her aspiration, but at the same time, I, like, don't. Congratulations on your recent birthday. Well, thank you, Mio. You got a sentiment with Lilith? Your first impression of Lilith was that she's immature. Yeah, yeah. And her impression of you is that you're an impressive person. And it's nice to meet someone who has a clear respect of others and everything around. Well, that's sweet. Thank you, Lilith. How about you go eat some food? Can can you forgive your sister? Like, I don't know what Paulina did to Bo, but every single time that Bo is around Paulina, she's, like, super angry. Look at this face she's making. Watch, watch. It's like, oh, this is so good. Anger. <laughs> she's so mad. Girl, get over it. Girl. Ugh, Quimba. You're so frustrated and you don't feel good, so you're going to beat up the dog, the kitty. Uh, let's try to order from the pharmacy again, okay? Girl, stop being mean to the kitty. Stop, stop it. Oh, you can go to acupuncturist? Acupuncture can be a great way to relieve stress and anxiety, reduce sickness, and generally calm oneself. Give it a try. Go for it. You go for it. I don't know... What I had in here. I think I just have the one painting. Oh, uh, what is this? It's an excellent painting. Wait, who made this? Oh, Amelia made it. And let's sell this for fame. And I'll have her make some more paintings. Uh, classic painting. Thank you, ma'am. Paulina is back. And she still seems to have some gastric issues. But her head feels better. A little bit. Just a little bit. Uh, she has an, a healthy aura from drinking the green tea. Girl, take you a nap. Okay. You get some rest. Oh my god, Bo. You're still feeling betrayed for another three hours? Blame for the pain. Bo wants to blame someone for the agony they put her through. Or maybe blame herself for giving them that power. I mean, girl... I don't think Paulina even realizes that you're still so mad about it. <laughs> Go take a shower. Okay, so the painting I had her made is not 
a masterpiece. It's just excellent. So we're going to sell that one. And let's try it again. Oh, sir. Get them out. Why, why are you crying? Why are you crying? Why, why is there something always wrong with you, child? Stop looking at me. He's mortified. Ah, uh, what was in the mail? I forgot I ordered that. Who needs it? I don't know. I don't know who needs it. I don't remember ordering it. Look at all these books you have. Let's sell them. 60 simoleons. Look at you. Go do your homework. Paulina. Like, girl. How are you not going to be nauseous if you just ate a freaking piece of cake? Go use the bathroom. Go. Go take care of yourself. Wait, wait, wait. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Sky's in there. Hang on. Uh, wait until they're done. Hang on. Well, I mean, you would be fine if you hadn't freaking sat there and ate some cake. Go use it. Go use it and then go take a shower. Curzon. Curzon. You okay, buddy? Uh, are you okay? Do you, you need some help? <laughs> Look at his eyes. So dramatic. <laughs> Oh my god, look at him go. Okay, dude. <laughs> He's gonna break that toilet. Cochino, why didn't you clean the toilet? And you're complaining. You're sitting on it. I swear. He needs to get something to eat. <laughs> I'm throwing this sushi out because that's how Paulina got sick. Dang, sushi. I love sushi. <laughs> I wouldn't mind some sushi right now. Get you something to eat and watch a movie. I can't wait till these boys age up and I can give them, like, well, they're going to get their dad's skin detail, I think. I want to see what they look like. Bo. Bo. Girl, your sister's over there dying and you're, you're so mad. She's got eight more hours of sickness. She should be fine for the next day of school. And she has a pile of clothing in her inventory. Just put it right there. Somebody will pick it up. <laughs> Somebody. I don't know where she got rock climbing gear. Like, I really don't. Maybe it was a gift? Hey, gents. Hey, gents. Hey, hey. Do you want to do some trolling of the forums? Oh, we don't have chairs. I for oh, gents. I'm so sorry. I'm so bad. I forgot that our chairs got stolen. <laughs> I was over here giving him a hard time because he wasn't trolling the forums. Your room is red, so we'll give you a red one. Uh, what's this? We'll give you a futuristic one. Look at that. Now, sir. Now, sir. Can can you control the forums, please? Thank you. Thank you so much. I forgot how much micromanaging there is in this household. Uh, draw all five pictures at the activity table. Uh, can you resume fall crafts? You didn't really have a whole lot of fun watching that. Uh, maybe you could play your violin for a little bit. Maybe that'll give you some fun. Play with some emotion. That should make you feel better. Put all that uh, embarrassment into it. Nice. Sky reached level 10. Good girl. So let's put that up here. That doesn't fit there. Oh, I'll fix it later. And you have to draw the pictures. I don't remember which ones you already drew. I see a vehicle right here. Um, I don't see a monster, so do a monster. And then go to sleep. Bo, are you still sitting there playing? Go to the bathroom, get you something to eat. Take you an angry poop and get you something to eat. What is it, Paulina? No, sweetheart, just go back to sleep. Go to sleep. You will soon be feeling better. <gasps> Guys, look at that. I've never seen that. Is it a masterpiece? No. Ma'am, ma'am. I need a masterpiece. Or like, I think it was like eight. I can fit in that. You're level eight oracle. I was kind of expecting a little bit more out of being an oracle. I'm not going to lie. That's like nothing exciting about the careers in this game. So I guess you can do some programming. And continue making a virus and maybe someday you'll finish. 
Why are you sleeping over there? What's what's wrong with your oh your sister's sitting on it for some reason? Girl, get out of there. This guy needs to go to sleep. Uh, did she finish it? Sweet, she finished it. Um, we're gonna go with let's do mental because we have some time before she ages up. She'll be able to do all the little whiz kid stuff, and plus, she likes doing it. So do that. Go to sleep though. I'm not sure what I want to be when I grow up, and. All my friends seem to have it figured out. How do I figure it out myself? Girl, no worries. You got time, okay? Even when we think we know what we want to do when we grow up and then we get there, like, and we're like, no, I hate it. <laughs> I don't want to do that no more. <laughs> Your fun is full. Good job. You're so cute, Carson. Shut your windows and lock your doors. Jens has released a virus into the wild. The sneaky piece of software has already netted him 636 simoleons. Good job. I didn't know you could do that. Or maybe I did and I forgot. Uh, what else can you do, sir? Um, I know you, like, you were already doing it. But, like, I messed up. And, like, oh my God, can you find programming, please? And can you, like... Continue making a mobile app. Thank you. Guys, look at this painting. Isn't that cool? I wonder if it's part of a mod or is this really in the game? Because if this is really in the game, that is so cool. I love that. We're going to sell it. Because, you know, I need to make a lot of money. And when do you have work? In nine hours. I think you have enough time to paint another painting. I think I'm going to leave it here for today. Um, I know this wasn't a very eventful episode, but I did show y'all the makeovers I did. <laughs> and um, we finally got uh, Jens to do stuff that we wanted him to do, like skill up his trolling. Um, again, I really do apologize. I've not been able to update the episodes and everything. Um, I really should have paid more attention to how much space I left I had left on my computer so that wouldn't have happened but you know it is what it is all part of life I do hope y'all enjoyed this episode I hope y'all uh, keep coming back to watch me and I should be able to post some more oh, they're so cute I'm so sorry about that episode being broken. I promise it was on purpose. Like, I promise that from now on, I will watch the episode before I export it. And I will watch it after I export it. That way, I'll make sure it exported properly. Um, Y'all, don't forget to like and uh, subscribe if you like my stuff. And leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of what I'm doing. I'll see y'all later. Bye.